Coach's Corner. I'm Joe Wamba, joined now with Andrew Bordelon, head coach of the men's soccer team, rounding out his first season at Stevenson. And, Coach, you finish off 4-2 to two at Lycoming over the weekend. A lot of youth contributing to the stat sheet there. Yeah, you know, we, we came into the game, started five freshmen um, mm-hmm. and, and and a couple sophomores. And, and really, I, I didn't notice it until it was even on the board. But, yeah, we, we've played a, a lot of young players this mm-hmm. year. Um, and I think that you saw that maturity through throughout the season. You know, it wasn't the result that we wanted. Um, you know, we, we struggled defending set pieces. But if you looked at the run of play of that game, um, I think that there were significant improvements in our play. I would agree with that entirely. Uh, the season is a progression. You know, it's a process that you're, the team is going through right now. And you played a lot of really tough teams at the beginning of the season, getting you ready for the conference tournament or conference season. Um, and it – it was working for a good good while of the uh, season. Um, what does that youth, you know, that progression, the arc of the season get you ready for, you know, working into the off season and getting ready for spring ball and then um, the years to come? Right. Well, I think that not only the maturity that we made, but it was the um, culture mm-hmm. and standard that was kind of set towards the end. Um, really needs to con- continue and even continue to move, progress also um, for us to get to where we want to be. The, like I said, the guys, the play improved every mm-hmm. week, um, and it's hard with especially a, a lot of youth contributing. Mm-hmm. But I think that the culture has improved quite a bit. But now going into spring, winter, spring, and summer, we really need to take that next jump if we want to continue to, to be – or get to the program that we want to be. And we hear that word a lot through all of our sports is the culture, you know, the process. It seemed to me when the team was, you know, performing well, which they did for the latter half of the season, I would totally attest to that. Um, It seemed that the team was working more cohesively. They bought into the system. They saw it paying off, and then they saw the rewards uh, working in their favor. Is that part of what one of the goals for the season getting to that point yeah you know the the goals of the season um you know are tricky again I try not to set too many goals mm-hmm. um you know I, I wanted to go in every day and continue to get better and I think results and goals kind of work themselves out um and, and obviously it wasn't a season that, that that we had hoped for um but there are positives to take from it and to continue to move forward and to build this piece um, of the puzzle, like I said, we're, to get this program where we need to be. Um, and you saw that. And, I, I, and, again, I think that it's hard. You know, a lot of the times we we, we first met each other on mm-hmm. August 19th, mm-hmm. um, and here it is. It's the end of October, um, so it's not a whole lot of time. Right. And so that, that progression um, really takes place in the off offseason, um, that culture that needs to be built things like that so now when this next group comes in to the locker room they fall right into place mm-hmm. and they know the standard that's set well coach we uh thank you for every week coming up and talking to us of and course. and post games as well yep. and we wish you the best in building that culture and continuing the process that you've been uh laying this season absolutely thank you he's andrew bordelon i'm joe wama and this has been the coach's corner